Marlborough House. The beauty of gems and jewellery can only be fully appreciated when matched with lovely women. There was an abundance of both when the 22 Commonwealth countries staged a combined fashion show called The Commonwealth in Time and Season. Princess Margaret was there to see the glamorous presentation staged in aid of the Commonwealth appeal of action for crippled children. The Nigerian look, a mixture of traditional and modern that were made for each other. Fashion from India, elegance and grace combined in perfect harmony. An oriental beauty modeling a fabulous white mink coat from Britain, a combination of east and west. And from Singapore, a creation called Lady Precious Stream. Exotic is about the only word to describe this wonderful lineup of fashion that calls on one fifth of the world for ideas. This Canadian swim set was modeled by a girl from Trinidad. Behind the scenes, Nigerian designer Shade Thomas assisted with a production which brought to London some of the world's top models representing Commonwealth countries. Taking her turn on the catwalk, Princess Elizabeth of Toro, complete with a way out hairdo and Jamaican ensemble. From top to toe, quite an eye catcher. But then everything on show had that look again look. Who wouldn't want to take another look at this cloak and bikini from the summertime land of Australia? A silver culotte dress from India. England stepped out in a style suitable for Sir Walter Raleigh or Batwoman, who cared which, it looked good. And from the land of the maple leaf, a two-piece evening outfit that was enough to make anyone look forward to that famous Canadian sunset. Heading south to warmer sunshine and a Jamaican design culotte dress that demonstrates the fashionable trend of the land where the rum comes from. But there's still a lot to be said for the timeless styles of the East, and Salon's a place where fashion is mystically marvellous and owes its elegance to tradition. Certainly not new, but does it matter? This beautiful gown was made a hundred years ago in Pakistan. It's hardly lightweight. There's almost 20 pounds of gold in the material. Delightful duet in a couple of styles that stemmed from Nigeria. This Commonwealth fashion show was surely one of the most glamorous gatherings of feminine haute couture ever staged. Color, beauty, style and elegance spanning a major part of the world's nationalities and national tastes, with London as the crossroads. And from such grand scale glamour will result so much good. It really was a marvelous show. <laughs>